Do you design and manufacture soft goods? This could be upholstery, composites, or inflatables. Using the power of 3D modeling software is a great way to ensure your products are made true to life. But what happens when you have to take into account manufacturing processes and tooling? What happens when you have to turn your 3D model into a 2D pattern? Well, there are a few methods that already exist, but typically they result in many, many iterations of an ever-evolving pattern. This could end up costing a lot of time and money and can significantly slow down a project. But what if there is a better way? What if we could utilize built-in validation capabilities to ensure we have the best fit for our design the first time, every time? This is where Exact Flat shines. It extends the capabilities of SOLIDWORKS to be able to tackle any soft good product, no matter how complex. You can get a flat pattern out to your cutter quickly in all in one continuous process. Exact Flat is a gold partner of SOLIDWORKS, which ensures full compatibility, and it allows you to take your product from design to manufacturing without leaving the familiar environment. Let's take a few minutes today to dive into Exact Flat and review its capabilities to see if it could be a good fit for your next project. Starting at the design stage, we work directly in SOLIDWORKS and can open the file we wish to flatten. In this case, it's an automotive headrest that we need to get a pattern for. This is a native SOLIDWORKS file, but ExactFlat will work on any geometry that can be inputted into SOLIDWORKS. We can navigate to the ExactFlat toolbar which has feature-rich tools to help us through every step of the process. Our first step is to create our panel pieces. Exact Flat makes this easy by simply selecting surfaces that are part of the same piece. I can even use box select or selection sets to speed up the process even further. I can choose which side of my material I want to cut on, which is important, due to some customers cutting the good side down for pen markings and some cutting good side up to monitor for material defects. The pieces are all automatically named and can default to numbers, letters, or custom values based on file names or other custom properties. Once we accept our piece creation, ExactFlat only shows the surfaces we are working with and visually separates each piece so we can make sure that we have selected the correct surfaces. The next step is applying a material to our pieces, as different materials stretch in different ways. In this case, we will be making a leather headrest, but these materials can easily be customized from an exact flat specific database and can be mixed and matched no matter how many materials you are working with. Once a material has been applied, exact flat automatically color codes out pieces to ensure that we have applied the correct material to the correct pattern piece. The next step is to jump into the flattener, where we can get a view of our mesh 3D and 2D models side by side and optimize them in real time. This gives us valuable insight into where there may be areas of high stretch or sag in our design, and can help us with modifying our design for the best stress relief. Not only that, but ExactFlat automatically calculates and solves the pattern to ensure the best fitting pattern for your design. Once our pattern is finished optimizing, we can accept the changes and the flat pattern is automatically updated to reflect the changes. We can jump into the pattern view and start organizing our panels. The move tools make it easy to position the pattern in the correct orientation and exact flat knows which pieces fit together and can automatically align based on edge orientation. Now that our pattern is aligned, we can easily add material allowances such as seams, hems, or bound edges and have full control over material length alignment notchings, and edge labels to make sure we know which pieces fit with which once our design makes it to the cutter. Exact Flat automatically grabs paired edges so you can add your material allowances in half the time. We've added our material allowance, but what about markings or hardware? This is as simple as a sketch in a couple clicks. Simply sketch where you want the marking or hardware and then we can assign it. In this case, let's add Velcro. And it gets mapped correcting to the pattern. Our pattern is looking pretty good now, 
and we want to line it up to our marker to prepare it for output to the cutter. In one click, we can get a full layout of our marker with dynamic information like marker cost and material utilization. ExactFlat can automatically lay out our material based on any lay rules of our choosing. Or if we have specified a grain direction for our material. With the professional version, we also have access to the powerful nesting capabilities built right into the workflow. And we can nest based on yield or time to try and maximize our material usage. Once our marker is the way we want it, we export it out as a DXF to a profile that our cutter can read. There are default profiles for many of the most popular cutters in the market today, but can be customized to suit any cutter profile that accepts DXF files. Now that we have our pattern for manufacturing, we need an accompanying drawing for floor staff to sew our pattern. Using native SOLIDWORKS functionality, we can quickly start drawing and insert our pattern view. ExactFlat has specific drawing tools that let us easily call out our pattern pieces, material type, and more. There are tables to track total material usage for the pattern or hardware cost. We can then use built-in dimension tools to add any relevant dimensional information to our drawing, and we are ready to send it to the floor. ExactFlat is the easiest path from concept to cutter. It can dramatically reduce the amount of time you spend designing and cutting soft goods. If you have any questions about what ExactFlat can do for you, or you'd just like to learn more, contact your Javelin representative today and let's streamline your pattern process.